In this video, I'll show you how to display and calculate the cost of goods sold in your WooCommerce store. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so for example, here we are on our back end, right? And I'm just placing an order and we can see this particular product costs $19.99. And we can see the profit we made on this product is $4.99, right? When we click to view into the order, here we can see the price of the goods that sold. And here we can see the cost of the goods sold. We can see our profit here. So I'll show you how to implement this on your WooCommerce store for free, right? And the first step is to head over to plugins and then add new, and then we'll just go ahead and search for cost of good souls, right? We just want to go ahead and enable this particular plugin here by WP factory. So I've already got it installed and activated. Next, we might want to go ahead and configure the settings even further. The default values in my case seem to work just fine, but we're still going to head over to WooCommerce and then settings. And then here we'll see this tab here, which is cost of goods, right? So we'll click on it. Right? We can customize the HTML template, right? We can choose how to get the price currently my store is set up to display the price without tax and um, decimal places again a lot of this is self-explanatory so i'll let you go through and then basically just go ahead and configure it accordingly right once you're happy with everything just hit save we've also got some additional tabs so for example on the order page we can add a cost column Right, we can even choose to display this cost column based on a particular status, right, of the order. So there's a lot of generous um, customization here, considering this is just a free plugin, right? There is a premium version. So as I said, I'll leave you to explore the different settings. Now let's head over to the product page and let's go ahead and add the cost per item and see how that process actually looks. So we'll head over to products and then all products. I'm just going to go ahead and edit this business plan template here. So we'll just click edit. So I've actually already added our cost um, price in here, right? So here's our regular price. And then we've got this new field here, right? So then we can enter in a cost for this item. When you save the changes, then it will calculate our profit. So for example, if I was to change this to say our cost is $6, the percentage here won't change. But when we hit save, then it will update accordingly. Okay, so having done that, moving forward, you'll be able to see the cost of goods goods sold for every new order, right? So for example, if we head back over to WooCommerce and then orders, since we've just increased the cost of goods sold, if we click on this order, which I've made earlier, we can still see the profit is $4.99 and the cost of goods sold is still $5, right? However, if we wanted, we can still adjust the cost of goods sold here. And then we can just hit update and here it's updated the cost of goods sold accordingly like and subscribe for more videos like this and if you've got any questions leave it in a comment box below